Welcome back to my channel. Again, we're here with mom. Hello. Um, this is my continuation of my school series. And if you're wondering why I am in the same outfit as my my lift video is because I'm filming these on the same day. So you were ready. I was ready. It was good day to film. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We, I was just trying to be productive today. So, um, oh, and if you haven't seen my previous, um, video on this, on this topic, I will link it in the cards. It will probably be right here, over here, in the cards. I will link in the cards, and I have a whole playlist, depending on what stage. You guys are in on your in your um journeys. <laughs> Another reminder: this is uh this is our this is our experience. That is not to say that every experience is different because every child's different and um every parent is different. So we're just hoping to help. Um, this video is gonna only gonna be all about my high school years. <laughs> Which is four years, if you guys are wondering. Yeah, because I'm ninth, yeah. ninth grade through twelfth grade. Yeah, mm -hmm. ninth grade through twelfth grade, because I know some schools do middle school and ninth, or seven through eighth. What? Yeah. Or seven through ninth. Whatever. <laughs> I messed up. Sorry. I'm not messing up. I'm just trying to. I'm just trying to keep it going. I know. You know. Um. So. This was my last transition. Oh. Um, transition from high school to yeah. F, they they work your school worked really hard no, with you on that too, which is will be another. We'll video. do another video, but saying this is my last transition on um, to different schools. Yeah. In the school system. Yes. I should say that I should clarify. We did the same thing as uh, for work. High school as we did in middle school. We toured it ahead of time, spent yeah. a day there. Um, Had the, oh, we went to each classroom, which I highly recommend again, because <laughs> that was um, very important to the teacher. It was just so good for you too, because you yeah. were very I nervous. was very nervous. Cause our, our school is three levels and- um, It has an elevator and it has stairs. Yeah. So yeah. I was a little nervous about the timing there were six minutes in between classes, blah, 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 blah. They didn't hold you to that, but. No, you know, yeah, but I, I'd I always. don't want to be late to class. Yeah, I always tried to, I, they were like, Anna, you can leave early. But what they don't realize is in the last five, the last five minutes in class are the most important five minutes. Well, they're a big important. Because it's typically. When you're getting your homework assignment, yes, or <laughs> or, or last-minute directions about a test, or or you're gonna have a quiz, or if you want any last-minute questions, mm -hmm. yeah, you're right. You're well, it's, you don't want to miss anything, and that's so, the hard part. Uh, yeah. And with the high school and the, just like the middle school, the team was huge, and and the team was fabulous. Yeah. Um, and something I forgot to say uh, about the middle school one, and I ran into her middle school art teacher um, and that's what made me think to say it um it's, the the thing is you know here they're having her take ceramics or art and keep in mind i have no coordination and no right she can't um, read it right and so i'm thinking she doesn't have enough coordination to write i have no coordination for anything so i'm thinking yeah. how can she do art how can she do ceramics how can she do any of that and they had to do fashion designing, they had interior design. Yeah. So and they then, a, I mean, they, what, but I guess my point was, is, you know, trust them. They exposed her to amazing classes and teachers and people and concepts that I would have never thought to expose her to. And she did really well with them, you know. Yeah, interior the, the, the designing teachers, was my favorite. I would have said, <laughs> yeah. The teachers were just very good. Well, you were good at it. Um, too, but back to the teachers were just very creative and very, um, they worked well together to come up with a way for Anna yeah. to do assignments and, and do it, but just in her way. Um, and, uh, so they did a great job with that. So don't, 
you know, kind of trust in that a little bit. If, if you know you have good uh, a good school system and, and teachers and an administration that care about the kids and really want them to do well, then trust in that. That's uh, they, they really will challenge your child and challenge um, you your in a child, way, too. <laughs> your child must, um, might be frustrated at the, like, situation. Yeah. And the fact that the teacher challenged them, but they'll get over it. <laughs> I don't mean to be like a... You got it's like anybody. You just have to, everybody, you'll, you'll, you'll have various challenges in your life and you just got to suck it they'll up. They'll get over it. it and later on, hopefully, if they're wise enough, I mean, not wise enough, but they'll see that it was not from a good place. And yeah, and it was meant to help you. Yeah. Yeah. I did, uh, one of the other things I do, speaking of those classes, um, at the high school level, they have uh, what they call adaptive gym. Oh, yeah, that's We it. didn't have that at any of the other levels. So no. we were kind of always leery of having Anna in gym. And as you all probably have guessed, the physical activity is really good for her, especially since um, getting insurance. Getting up and getting active. Well, and, and insurance doesn't really Cover constitute ther uh, uh, therapy. You, yeah, therapy. So, so we were you know, dealing with Jim and then the PT and the OT oh. through the school, not through oh. any outside therapy. And also we'll make a whole video on, on my surgeries and on therapy. Yeah, another time. Another time. So, but, um, so the, but I was just a great um, thing that they had this adaptive gym and they had peer, you know, their peers that would help them. And it was just kind of good. I, Anna was, it was a thing. Anna was not a, a big fan of it at first, at but, first. but then she started, you did grow a lot during this I time. Did, <laughs> I did grow a lot. Because it's good, good activity for her and stuff. And she had and grown compression, much. And it gives me compression. When you stand on your feet, it yeah. gives your bones compression. And that helped you grow. Yes. So it was a good, I'm it just was overall saying, a good thing for her. I'm just saying. And your peers. It was a class for you to get to be with your peers. Yeah. And the teachers were very good at supporting you yeah. and encouraging you and trying to help you find a career, find, help you find a future. Yeah. And that's pro that's where I'm going to bring up. Um, it was actually just be or because of Ms. Jobonasi, which mm -hmm. is my English teacher, I was my English teacher for three years. I am writing a book, so you can thank yeah. her and well, <laughs> I think it's a good book. So hopefully, not like um, <laughs> when it comes out. When yeah, it when it. But she encouraged you and said, "This is something you could do. I see yeah. your potential." And, yeah. and Mrs. Briggs backed her up on it. Another special ed teacher, yeah. but she, I think she had English. Didn't she have you for English one yeah, year? Yeah. Yep. So. Freshman year. So anyways, that was, um, so, the, so those were, this is what was really interesting because they, you know, they saw some things in Anna that, you know, I would have probably totally blown up. There was one day though, the elevator wasn't working. Yeah. I know it was up on the third, third floor. Yeah. Third floor. And the, the bus as you get, you yeah. catch the bus is on the first floor. Yeah. That's stupid. And, um, I think it should so... be second floor, but that's, <laughs> anyways. Um, so they carry so, four, four, four of the staff, a principal, yeah, an a assistant principal, principal, and the system principal, and the athletic and, director. Yeah, that. And, well, one principal had to carry me because apparently I'm a quadriplegic. So I can't walk down the stairs. That, her uh, wheelchair weighs 300 pounds. I mean, 380. Two, 288. Of um, 288. That's just the wheelchair. Plus my 100 pounds. So, I mean, they carried that down all those um, stairs. But they took me out of it, though. I want to well, say yeah, that. They they, no, they were. I told them, I said, I would have. Yeah. They had called me. I would have said, leave her chair there. I will go get her. And she will just do without it for the night. And I and, said, I even said, do you want me to call mom? Because yeah, my mom yeah. to pick me up. And then they're like, then I'm like, they're like, what's going to happen with your chair? And I was like, well, we'll, we'll just leave it here for the <laughs> night. And they're like, how are you going to get in your house? I'm like, I have a second meal chair. I'll be fine for yeah. 24 hours. And manual, like, we had a manual. Okay. And they were like. Uh. They, I mean, that was amazing. I just but, could not believe they did that. Anyways. And I just felt so bad. I just really um, can't can't say enough nice about that. And I just, I didn't want anybody getting injured. And I, yeah, God, they did not. They did. They were probably sore the next I day. I love yeah. <laughs> or two, but oh my gosh. In high school, was a lot of team talk classes. Oh, yes. Too. Again, again I the love team talk. The team great, talk. It's a great way. To I go. love it. So, so I was in resource math 
up until eighth grade. Well, they don't have resource math in um, my high school. They only had team taught. Mm -hmm. So I was in the team taught. Um, algebra one, algebra two, we algebra one. Everything team taught. That brings up another point: the ACT. You did take it. Sorry. Um, you did no. I'm just saying. You they, have because, to take it to graduate. She was diploma. Um, and they did do accommodations for her. For yeah, it. you have to mm -hmm. take it to like get your diploma and to graduate. So I had to take it. Um, and, your, and, and Mrs. Briggs had to write up special requests for the accommodations, but she took it and, and they. Uh, I got my diploma. <laughs> the uh, ACT. Yeah. <laughs> but, but I'm just saying they made accommodations and, and yeah. it took extra, they had to do some extra work to get and those it, accommodations. It took you, me but. three three days, three days straight of testing yeah, to got, get it done. But, you got it done. but I got it done. I'm not saying it's not. Um, uh, I'm not saying go me. <laughs> I'm just saying you survived that, it. That's and, what you mean. Yeah. Yeah. I'm just saying it took extra work for everybody, even including the student. You were just saying it took persevere. Persevere, and I still had to do all my classes, even though um, I still had to function for the rest of the day when I was done with it. But, you, but I'm saying you encouraged other kids that they could do it. Yeah, it's, not... it's gonna be, it's gonna be hot. It's gonna be hot. Um, really, it's gonna be hard work. I won't deny that. They were really good even about at finals time that you had the Cons right, the right, um, Cons the best pair pro for her. Yeah, okay. Thank you guys for watching. I will link this in the card. I will link my other videos in the ca cards. And I also have a playlist if you guys, if you guys are just stepping upon this video. And if any, and if any of the Heartland High School staff members uh, are watching, thank you for all you did. Really, hi, everybody. All these, years, these years later, we still remember it well and still think of you all with great fondness. So thank, thank you very much. I don't think anybody's watching that. Never know. Just <laughs> Never know. <laughs> thank you guys for watching. I will um, please subscribe if you haven't already. And. Um, we'll see you next time. I uh, will see you next time. Please leave a comment down below what, what video you want to see next. And um, I want to make content you guys enjoy. And um, have a great day. Have a great day.